Okay, so what I've done is I've, I'm getting ready to pour right now. And uh, I filled this up with water so I could use the water as a level to level this all off. I just did it in the dirt and I used this rake to just rake the, the, rake the mud so it was nice and level. And what I also did is um, when I filled it with, I filled it with water beforehand uh, to make sure it was not going to leak for one thing. And then I used that water to fill the, wheel bar the wheelbarrow I'm going to be mixing in to make sure, um, to see how much uh, volume it took to fill up the mold. To see, to make sure that one bag of cement was going to be enough. And it looks like it's just right. So this is the, uh, this is the concrete I decided to use. It's the 5,000 plus high strength mix. I, I was debating between this and the fiberglass reinforced concrete. Um, I decided to go for this because it says excellent for concrete countertops. And I think that's an application pretty close. Um, to the needs that we're gonna have. Um, so I'm going with this. Um, I was originally planning on having rebar that I'd cut to go to the length of this thing, but um, I just wanna get this done today. So I'm gonna try and see if it'll work without it. Um, I wouldn't do it without reinforcement except for the fact um, that this is going to be having a VLAM backing. So it should actually have a backing that's really strong that should, um, should provide uh, enough strength. So what I'm mostly looking for from the concrete is that it takes the shape. So um, we'll see if that works. If not, I'll be able to make another, uh, another casting. Um, so let's, let's get this going here. It's a shame the light isn't better. So I'm gonna first see if there's, read the directions. So it says to use four quarts um, for about every 80 pound bag. So that's a gallon of water. So I've got a milk gallon. So all I've gotta do is mix it up. I wish the lighting was a little better, but it's not. Um, I'll use this bucket as a scoop. I just need to find something to, to trowel it up with. I think it should be good. Avoid a soupy mix. Looks like I'm a bit low. Um, I think it probably lost some volume once I added the water. This is probably what happened. So I'm going to open my other bag up and try to do about a third of that bag. And that will give me enough, uh, maybe more like a quarter of the bag. But I want to have enough where it's over the top and I can, I can level it off. And you can see it's just not quite there yet. Okay. 
Bye.